Davis and Shirtliff is a fine example of adaptability in today's modern world, where the third industrial revolution is transforming the business landscape like never before. What was not happening 20 years ago in solar is happening now. Today we are able to drive uh, solar pumps, even big pumps, you know, big in size. And that's how you've seen the projects that uh, you saw being done at country. In the last three years, we have seen a, a, a real growth in solar and in pumping and in irrigation. Well, Davis and Shatliff, uh, we've gone into another model of doing business. That is public-private partnership. It's a new model of getting a private sector and public sector coming together to develop a solution to our disadvantaged communities. And we are lucky that uh, we've pioneered in this in Uganda. Pioneering in public-private sector projects has been the lead transformative strategy, enabling massive projects to get off the ground. When Davis and Shirtliff team up with the public sector, vulnerable communities benefit. Davis and Shirtliff is a leader in providing new technology that improves people's lives. The prepared water dispenser you see here is one of a kind in this country. We are the first and the leading company in providing this technology at this scale. Grunfos Actap Water Dispenser is an intelligent water dispenser offering a unique and integrated platform for revenue collection and lifelink solutions addressing the sustainability challenges in water services. The people accessing water today are access, accessing this water at almost half the previous cost. So it has come with a, a huge financial saving for the people because uh, the government dictates the rate at which the water should be dispensed and that rate is uniform and is applied and set in the aquitaf. Davis and Shirtliff takes pride in being a competent and competitive professional outfit which have applied and won for many bids enabling them to work with the government of Uganda, international organizations and individuals in Uganda. Uh, through a competitive process and this was an open bidding process uh, by, under the guidelines of the World Bank and they emerged as the successful bidders. They have been doing a good job, so on that basis, oh, and they passed the technical evaluation and they, in addition to the financial evaluation, so that's why we outsourced Davis and Shirtliff. Embracing and mastering technology, as well as creating end-to-end -end solutions, have moved the company forward from a simple model of selling equipment such as pumps, generators and solar panels to delivering solutions to the satisfaction of the customer. The scheme we've just implemented here at Mukunga is um, a 20 kilowatt system powering an 11 kilowatt three-phase pump, pumping 17,000 liters per hour. It's a state of a technology because the system can be monitored remotely. You can know how much water you are pumping per hour. You can know how much water you pumped last month. And it helps the user and us to monitor the system performance. In form of service delivery, I think this is the best technology because it uses renewable energy, which is there, it's the sun. It's not toxic to the environment. The challenge they used to have was uh, maintenance. Costs were very high. The amount of water pumped was being limited by the amount of fuel they had. But since we installed this solar pumping system, they can now pump an amount of water they want. We have advanced much more that now we have what we call hybrid systems. One inverter can have three sources of energy. Now that is a very serious breakthrough. Using the renewable power of the sun and highly advanced technology together with the expertise of specialist engineers brings to life unique solutions for some of the most disadvantaged communities all over Uganda. What we are doing for our partners in water is to help them get low cost, efficient and renewable energy to pump water. So that makes water also more affordable for the people and uh, sometimes even the measures of, uh, of acceptance are far beyond price. When we get clean water, one, it reduces the time wasted in, in going to fetch water. 
that time is going to be used to produce other things uh, for economic gain. And the role of energy as part of our, the mandate is for the ministry is the utilization of energy for social development. Davis and Shetliff have been able to accomplish the full installation of 20 solar-powered schemes across Uganda, among them Buvuma in Lake Victoria Islands, Namayumba in Wakiso District, and Buhunga in Rukungiri District, all of which have been commissioned and handed over. After the construction of the project of the system, we are supposed to hand it over and the community have to be well prepared to take over and run the facility. Actually, we have a defects liability period for six months uh, where we shall keep on coming to check on the performance of the system. Uh, Davis and Sachleaf has fully fulfilled on this commitment under the contractual obligations and they've delivered the contract both in time, within cost, and to the quality and specifications which were stipulated in the contract. Yes, Davis and Shatliff has met our expectations. They completed this work in December 2018, according which was contractual because the work started in March. And then after that, we are ready to take over the systems back into our, into our hands. They've done good work to install this energy system to serve the pumping water supply scheme. Corporate social responsibility is a serious commitment to Davis and Shetliff. Yes. Davis and Shetliff is also involved in CSR programs and among which on an annual basis we are agreed we will be supporting the cancer run. We also do other activities, especially those that are in line with the products we sell. We've managed to provide um, some pumps providing water to this kind of institutions. It's indeed right and fitting for Davis and Shetliff to contribute to the communities that we are working with.